Listen up or run for cover. Bradley Bums. is dropping. Bums. I also noticed that when they're being recorded for later yeah. sales or use, yeah. that when you have PowerPoints, the camera's not on you. Well, you see, it, it depends on the setup. See, a lot of the conferences, they will have the speaker is in iMag and then they have screens each side. Mm -hmm. But I know if, if, if it's just going to be one or the other, yeah, the slides up there, especially if they're 5,600 people, you look like an ant. No, I want them to see me or the speaker. Exactly. Now, here's another. Now, see, I did that just accidentally. Yeah. I'm like, no PowerPoints. So they said, why? I said, so then I'm on the big screen. Exactly. Now, here's one. Most speakers think they're being dynamic if they're walking up and down the stage. Yeah, not true. Stand still. Well, what you do at the beginning, you stand still. How you stand at the beginning represents the stability of your ideas and the stability of the company you represent or your philosophy. At the beginning, people are getting used to your voice, so you're standing with authority. Now, I'm not saying don't move, but move on purpose. It's very obvious you mean to be moving when you're still looking at the audience. But when you get to what I would call a point of wisdom, you stand still. Wherever you are on the stage, you stand still. And that, the audience, oh, i got to write this down. So you move on purpose, but stand still for the key lines. Then you might move on transition. And the session where, second way you will drive your success is, so you're moving from one talk to the next, or a movement-specific phrase. So if you were saying, when you're in Vegas, you got to walk into the light speed office. And when you get to the second floor, they'll bring you back to my office. They'll show you around our studio. In other words, these are movement-specific phrases. So you could say, You'll check in the reception and they're going to bring you to my office. Now we imagine you in your office. We're going to have a conversation. Then I'm going to give you a personal tour. You're going to see the green rooms. You're going to see where we record dropping bombs. You're going to see where we create. We have celebrities create the best content. So you see, you're moving around the office. But when you're in there saying this is where we're dropping bombs, you stand still because we're looking around this room. Now, is there a, is there a, um, this is the past and this is no, the future? No, 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 no. As the audience looks at you, if you look at me, put out what is your right hand. All right. As the audience is looking at you, that is the past. So when you say, when I first started in sales, you either gesture that way or walk that way if you're going to move. Yeah, so... Five years ago. ago, yes, and now, yes, I'm over here. So, it. so their right is the future. Their left is the past. No, your well, as the audience is looking at it, it your right, right is their left. Right. So it's how we read. Right. So, so my right is the past. Yes, as, you say as I am looking at it. And yeah. The left is the future. Yeah. Their left is the past. Yes. And their right is the future. Well. Yes, as they're sitting looking at you. Oh.